All right, YouTube, what is up? This is your boy Apathy, and today I'm bringing a new series, but I did do it in Ghost SD Tricks, Tips, and Spots. I'm introducing it today in this little video right here. I'm going to be showing you guys some SD tips very shortly, but before I do that, I want to show you guys look where I'm at out of bounds, but no problem. I'm always top three and really up top. You guys can see I'm really high above, and this is just a spot that I want to show you guys introducing my video, but let's get right into it. All right, for tip number one, what people need to understand, especially when it comes to planning and diffusing, uh, I believe it's like a 0.5 second difference. You can't exactly diffuse. If you pick up the bomb at 7.5, it's not going to work. What you want to do is pick it up at 8. I'll show you. I'm going to pick it up exactly at 7. Point. I think I picked it around 7.3, something like that. Like I was nowhere near close. So you guys saw in the last video, I picked it up at 7.3. I picked it up at 7.23 and obviously it didn't work. So here I'm going to pick it up at 8 seconds to show you guys that, you know, the 8 second is serious. So yeah, I picked it up at 8 seconds, 0.5 animation. I should easily have this bomb. Uh, if it's anything less than 8, and I barely got it too. So you saw I, I went for the pickup at 8. Obviously if I picked it up around 8.5, I would have easily had it. But there, you always got to remember that. Just think about it in your head when playing. The fuse time is 8 seconds. Always think like that. 8 seconds. Plant time is 5.5 seconds. So a cool trick a lot of people know and don't know is the fast diffuse and slow diffuse. And how, people always wonder how do you do it. Well, it's pretty simple, guys. You know, you start diffusing. You, ha you have to sprint. Sprint and, and move it around. Sprint. If you, ho if you keep sprinting and you don't move it around, for example, just sprinting forward, it's going to slow motion it. If you want it to keep going really, really fast, you just keep sprinting and keep moving your analog stick left and right. And that's for that cool animation trick. All right, guys. Second last tip for when come for the introduction of SD tips and tricks and spots. You see that bomb blinking, whether it's on the floor or wherever it is. If, if the bomb is still blinking and you see that red light just constantly blinking, that means they're not on the bomb. And that means you're pretty much safe to go, you know, you're safe to roam, roam around. As soon as that bomb stops blinking, then obviously the guy is on the bomb. But you guys can tell, especially when it comes to a dead body being on the floor or being on top of it, or maybe there on top of it, you can see that little blink, and then that shows and indicates that no one is defusing a bomb. So you guys got to think about that. I know there comes a lot of situations when you see a dead body on bomb, you're like, oh, he's defusing, you start shooting the dead body. But that's actually not true. It's just a dead body. Remember that. Red blinking. Alright, so a quick tip for you guys. When when you kill bomb guy, it makes a huge dung kind of noise. It's not that loud, but it is noticeable. That means bomb is down. This could be really crucial and very important. This guy right here has bomb, and I'm going to show you really quick. A-bomb, 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 A-bomb. Green side, green side, A-bomb. That's bomb, that's bomb. Bomb down. Alright, so if you guys heard the first one, you guys noticed that it wasn't too loud, but you still hear a little bum. And that basically means bomb is down. The second one, I picked it up from some other guys' gameplay on YouTube. Uh, shout out to him. Uh, you guys saw in that little clip that as soon as he kills the guy, he, the guy, the player says bomb is down, knowing that that is bomb without even seeing it just due to the sound. And you do hear the little dum if you want to go ahead and replay it. So that's a cool tip and trick for you guys to know. Uh, that indicates bomb down and that could be really huge for you guys. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little introduction of s and tips and tricks. This had kind of, I would say, a lot to do with it, yet nothing to do with it. I was just showing you guys some tips and cool tricks and stuff for your gameplay. But I'm breaking. I'm basically going to be breaking down every single map, showing you guys a whole mess of spots, a whole mess of tricks, a whole mess of things. I think you guys are going to love the videos. I, have, I know so much spots and stuff like that. And it's going to be really fun to do it. So... Thank you guys for watching. I hope you learned a little bit today and can help you further your S&D skills. This has been your boy Apathy, and I'm out.